St. Patrick's Day integer bingo. This is a digital bingo game, and it's all addition and subtraction problems. All of the instructions are on slide two. There are 26 different bingo cards, and if you have more than 26 students, you can just click on one of the slides on the left-hand side and come up here to slide duplicate. And you can duplicate as many different slides as you need. All of the problems you're gonna call out to the students, addition and subtraction, are on slide three. So as you use these, just click and hold on the edge, move them to the right hand side, and that way you know which ones you've used. At the end of the game, just come up to the undo arrow, click it repeatedly, and all of the problems go right back into place. I give the students editing rights so they can scroll up and down, find the bingo card that they want, and I instruct them to just click in one of the chips and then type their name or initials. And that way, um, students know that this board has been claimed and they need to find another one. So as you're calling these out to the students, they're going to find the answer on their bingo card. They're going to click and hold on a chip and move it to cover the answer. When they get five in a row, they can call out bingo. And if you want to check their answers, just have them move the chips to the side. And that way you can check and see if they're correct. At the end of the game, the students can come up to the undo arrow, click it repeatedly. All of the chips go back into place and their name comes off the chip. And that way, if they want to play again, they could scroll up and down and find a different bingo card and play a second time. So this is St. Patrick's Day Integer Bingo Addition and Subtraction.